Hey, good morning. Kyler Hawthorne here from Veracity Motors. I just wanted to shoot you a real quick walk around video on our 2018 GMC Sierra SLT that we just got in stock here. This one's got about 80,000 miles on it. We've got it Veracity value priced at 32.5. So I'll go ahead and show you the overall condition of it, some of the awesome features it has to offer and everything like that. All right, here it is. The 2018 GMC Sierra 1500 SLT. Like I said, overall, this is a very nice truck. We just got this thing in stock here this morning. Uh, so it has not gone through our detail process yet. Uh, this is exactly how we received it. So obviously the previous owner took pretty dang good care of it because it is in excellent condition. And this SLT does have the preferred uh, equipment package. So overall, it is loaded with features. So starting off at the front, you've got a very nice set of HED headlights got a really nice set of LED running lights wrapped around that. This one does have the full 360 parking sensors. So up here in the front bumper, you've got your sensors. And then you got a really nice chrome trim on this one as well. Here's what your wheels are looking like. Very nice set of wheels. And the tires on this thing are in great shape. You've got tons of life left in them. Got a very nice set of running boards on this one as well. Makes it nice and easy to get in and out of the truck. This one has the five and a half foot box on the back of it. You've got a very nice roll up tonneau cover on here. And then here's what the bed is looking like. Full spray and bed liner from factory. So you don't have to worry about throwing stuff back there and hurting your bed. And then you've also got your reverse camera right here. And then again, you got those 360 sensors here in the back bumper and all of your tow hookups back here as well. Here is what your interior is looking like. Got a really nice set of black leather seats on this one with the white stitching. Overall, they are in excellent condition. And being the crew cab, you've got tons of space in here. You can lift these seats up, lock them into place. So if you need more ground storage, you've got plenty of room for it. And then here's what things look like up front. Again, you've got this really nice black leather interior. All of your seating controls are just down here on the side, so you can move that seat forwards or backwards. You can adjust your backrest and then your lumbar support as well. And then over on the door, here's kind of what things look like over here. So you got a really nice chrome door handle on here. You got your memory seating right up top. All of your power mirror controls, your power door locks, your power windows, your power window locks, and then your child locks. You got a really nice wood grain on here as well. And then you've got a nice set of uh, storage cubbies here in the door. Hopping into the driver's seat here, here's kind of what things look like. So you'll notice right off the bat, you got a very nice digital center stack on here. Lots of great driving information that is available to you. If you want to adjust any of that information, all you have to do is use the arrows here on the right side of the steering wheel. And you can scroll up or down through the different information available. If you go to the left, you can access the different pages that are available to you. And you can make a selection on one of those and scroll through uh, the different menu options that are available to you there. Like I said, tons of great driving information available to you. Um, so very nice setup there. A couple other buttons you got here on the steering wheel. So over on the right side here, of course, you've got your cell phone buttons. You got your voice recognition assistant as well. Over on the left side is gonna be your cruise control stuff. So you've got, of course, your cruise control to turn on or off. You can cancel it, set it, resume previous speed. This one's also got the pre-collision detection system on it. So you can hit this button and, uh, and basically select the distance at which that system kicks on. And then you've also got your heated steering wheel on here, which is very nice during winter. Just behind the steering wheel here, you've got your multifunction switch for your brights and blinkers, and then also your windshield wipers. And then just behind that, you've got your shifter. Over here on the left, you've got a couple of different controls. So up top, you've got your factory trailer brake. Down below that, you've got your four-wheel drive controls. And then down below that, you've got your headlight controls. 
Over in the center console, this is kind of what your entertainment section is looking like. So you've got a nice big eight inch touchscreen on here. It's got pretty much all the modern capabilities, AM, FM, satellite, Bluetooth, uh, all of that different stuff. So it's also got the Bose sound system in it. So fantastic sound system, really great bass. The mids and highs are very nice and clear. Uh, like I said, overall, great sound system. Just below your screen here. Oh, oh, one other thing that the screen does have, like I mentioned, you've got that reverse camera. It is a little wet because of the rain, um, but makes backing up super easy, hooking up trailers and all that stuff. Super easy. Uh, just below that, you got some radio controls here. You've got your CD player. And then just below that, you've got all of your climate controls. So dual climate control on this one, you can set that temperature uh, individually per each side of the vehicle. So if you're getting a little bit hot, you can turn your side down. If your passenger is a little bit cold, they can turn their side up and they can set it all independently. If you want it to sync up, you can hit this sync button. It'll match the driver's side. And then it's also got the automatic mode on it. So you can just hit this auto button, kind of like a home thermostat, you just set the temperature to whatever you want and it'll automatically adjust fan speeds, temperatures, all of that different stuff for you. Uh, just to the left and right, you've got your heated and cooled seats for your driver. And then your passenger is just over here. And then just below that, you've got your power pedal adjustments, your traction control, your bed lighting, your parking sensors that you can turn on or off. This one has the lane guidance system on it, so it'll read the lines on the side of the road and can help physically keep you in between those lines. And then you've got your uh, downhill uh, descent controller. Just below that, you've got a few different ports here. So you've got your USB charging ports for cell phones and that type of stuff. You've got two 12 volt ports for your accessories. And then over on the right, you've got your uh, 110 plug. Just below that, you got a really nice center console here. So tons of storage space available to you. You've got these cool little cubbies here, perfect spot to set your cell phone. Just below that, you've got a nice big cubby here. And then you've got your cup holders. Uh, these are uh, fixed in place. Sometimes they're removable on these, but uh, these ones are fixed. Just behind that, you've got a wireless charging pad built into your armrest here. And then you've got a nice big center console here. You've got a couple of other USB charging ports and 12 volt ports uh, and tons of storage space available to you. Over on the passenger side here, you've got your double deck glove box. You got the upper and lower. So tons of storage space available to you in this truck. And then here's just kind of another general overview of how everything is looking in the 2018 GMC Sierra 1500 SLT. All right, so like I said, just a real quick walk around on the 2018 GMC Sierra. If you have any questions, if there's anything else you wanna see in more detail, just let me know. You can reach me here at the store, 701-258-2277. Just ask for Kyler. Thank you.